All right, we've got our tools and we're going to make a raised bed today. So let's go over the things you need. You need a plastic 50 gallon drum like we have. You need some scrap wood and just a couple of tools at this point. So we need a rind, a rind this is a right angle grinder, but you can also use maybe a jigsaw or a saber saw. You need your power drill and I've got ours all souped up with a 3 8 inch bit. Now I need some help because we've marked our barrel, you can see here, right in half. So this is 50 gallon drum, it's ready to go. Bill, can you help me out? Sure. So we're going to toss this up just to give it a good spot to cut. So I'm going to get out of the way and let him cut this in half. Do I need any safety rules? Yeah, so you're going to create hot plastic, so make sure that when you do that that you have at least safety glasses on. And in some cases you probably want to wear gloves too. Okay. Okay, so we cut our barrel and as you can see, one half of this is a little deeper than the other half. And you can always use these openings as a little bit of drainage for your, your raised bed. So we did this for two reasons. One, because we wanted to get two barrels out of this, but one, another reason is some roots are deeper for some plants, some are more shallow. So this is a shallow bed we're going to use for things like lettuce and radishes, something easy that grows right on top. This might I use, this little side I'll use for something that grows a deeper root like tomatoes and peppers. You ready? Can you take this top off for me? Sure. Where do you drill the drainage holes? Come on, I'll show you. So the water will naturally just settle here in the lowest part of your raised bed. So I want to, I want to drill some holes here and then just about two inches up, I'll make another line of a few holes here. And then on the opposite side, we'll, we'll drill some more holes here on this. So we've got three lines and we'll drill these holes about two inches apart. Here you go, Bill. So you know it's all about the base, so let's talk about it. Let's measure these. This is reclaimed wood and we've used an old door, 37 inches. I've got four pieces that are 37 inches and cross bucks here that are 30 inches. We used a few screws to hold it all together, but the best part of all is it's adjustable and by doing that we use a 3 8 inch bolt with a wing nut and a washer. Go ahead and put your barrel back up on there. Good. And All right. See similar heights. See, it's easy to make your own raised bed. Let's get out there and get growing. 